Hello and welcome. In this video, we are going to learn how to use routing in, in Angular 6. This is very, very simple. As you can see, we have our navigation. I want you to uh, make it like this. If someone click on the home, it should show the home page. If someone click on the link, it should show like the about page or any other page without refreshing the page. That is how routing is going to work in Angular. So let's see how we are going to build it. First of all, let's clean up a little bit our uh, navigation i will go to the app in the navbar the in the html i will clean some of the unnecessary drop downs here as you can see these are the things we don't need the disable one even the form is extra here so what we have is the home with a current i will just remove that one i will make the home to about for now it is just fine and I, I will just remove the active from the home as well if I refresh the page as you can see we have home and about how we are going to make it work like if I click on the home it should display home page if I click on the about it should display the about page and it should show the content of the about component and the home component like that it is very simple to do that all you need to do is uh, open your app module and import your router uh, at the top if you go to the documentation of the angular.io here they will tell you that uh, you must have the base url in your index.html by default you have it if you open the index as you can see the base url you have it next up you should import them just copy it and import at the top of your module here app.module here next up you should create your uh, uh, your route here as you can see if i come down here your routes should be a constant of app routes you can create them here oh, of course you can just copy it and later you can customize it for example i will remove some of them for now we don't need them and i will remove this comma it is very simple you have a constant app route it is just like a variable then it will be a, a route route as you can see we have import that routes is we have import that it is in the angular directory as you can see we have imported that here and now we can it you can just give it an array like this one the array will accept a path and a component the path is the url for example if someone go to the home directory which component you want to display of course the home component as you can see we have imported the home component here for the other one if someone go to the about page what you want to display the about component here this is this much simple that's it for the basic routing of course there are some other way you can send data to the route you can just uh, send to any other uh, url and redirect to other url you can just uh, for the last one you can say that if uh, they send to, if they just say any gbrush or any url that does not exist you can show a component like a 404 or not found component like that for our example this is just a simple component and for now it will not work because this is not all you need to do you should import them in your imports module here as you can see this is a decorator decorator is something new in e typescript of course currently the uh, javascript is not supporting it and this is decorator this is a new feature but in angular projects you can use it uh, so let's see how you can import it uh, if you come down here you should uh, uh, in your import just write this line of course this much oh, okay, okay you can write all and then you can you can customize it under your imports you can write the router module as you can see we have imported here from the router module here and then this is for the child root or for the root here and for the root of your application uh, and then it, this one is for of course for debugging you can just remove this and you can pass the app routes here app routes is the available we have created here as you can see then you save it if you save it and come to the application here if you refresh it for now it will not work just fine because you have to say where you want to display the route the component data if i come down here we have the route outlet route outlet is where you want to display your route uh, information for example we if someone click on the about it should take content from the about page and display it here so i will come to our application here 
into the component instead of the this text here I will just write the out the router outlet here I will save it next step you should change the way you have written the URL instead of the href you will use the router link and you will give the value as the value you specify for the home we will we said that the path is home for the about again you write router link and then the value is about save it and then refresh your application sometime you should uh, just refresh it twice it is not working for now if I click on the about and on the home it is going to the home URL and it will display the home works here if I click on the about it will just display it here without refreshing the page very simple and very quick as you can see in our uh, pages we have our about in the HTML all we have is a very short paragraph um, paragraph here for the home page again of course you can just write a lot more here in informative for you if you have any question feel free to ask below the video and I will answer them thank you for watching